YouTube, what's good, man? Fargo family. It's your boy, Long Way, Fargo. Y'all, uh -huh. coming from the other way. Back up, camera. I don't know if y'all can see it or not. A back up, camera. But yeah, man. So, we leaving this little Dollar General right here. See what I'm saying? Everybody we see strapped up COVID-19. Mask on, capes on, you know what I'm saying? Bruh man right here tying a shirt around his his head. Look at that. Tying a shirt around his, look at that, shirt. So I get into a conversation with a brother man. Uh, hey man. Well, it really wasn't even a brother man. It was just like me talking to the wife. Talking about, like, damn baby, I feel uh, some type of social security way. Everybody got masks on, strapped up. 2019, 2020, COVID-19. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, dang. So dude next to me, you know, he strapped up shawty like working a little mechanic shop, I guess, right? He said, yeah, man, it's bad in this area. It's bad in this area. I looked at him, I said, it's bad everywhere, bro. Me and my wild truck drivers. I've been out here eight years. She's been out here four years, man. Uh, It's bad. Laredo, PA, California. It's bad everywhere. Now, if it was mandated, that uh, you wasn't going to service me, uh, as they say, no shirt, no shoes, no service, you feel me? Then I'd be strapped up shouty, you know what I'm saying? I got the bandana in there, you know, me and my wife got the mask, you know. But like, like I kind of talking to my wife, you know what I'm saying? I ain't saying that I'm ready to die or she ready to die, but you know, I done had a good life, man. Like I told my wife, just bury me with these goals out, you feel me? Y'all, you know, but... I don't know if everybody's taking it too far or not, but I think at the end of the day, Fargo family is like this here. This is what I want to tell you. Check me out. Hold on, let me get a vape right quick. They taking everything to heart, the CDC is saying. Yeah, you see the wire right there. Uh, you know, taking it to the heart. But I think at the end of the day, if it's your time, you can't pick and choose when it's your time to go. It's time to go, you finna call your home. You know, you finna call your home. But what I was telling my wife is, the hardest mother suckers out here, no Joe Puck Puck, P, P, and P, Elemento, and Z, out here got mask on. And soon as all this stuff blow over, like the rest of the viruses that we've had in the United States of us in America, blows over, right? They're gonna be the strongest one, man. I was out here, man. I was out here thugging in this COVID-19, man. I don't need no mask. I, 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 I ain't never wore no mask, man. Uh, uh, it, I, I've been ready to go, man. I'm out here in the street selling dope, man. Uh, they could have, man, please. You was the one I seen down the street at the car wash outside, inside your car with gloves on and a mask. I think they just taking it too far. I think people want something. It's a fad. You know, it's kind of like when gold teeth was in, when uh, my mama, my tea lady, got her gold teeth back in the 80s, you see what I'm saying? She still got her gold teeth. You know, everybody want to do what everybody want to do. Everybody want to go get J's. You know, everybody want to rock this. Everybody want to rock that. Man, I don't sag my pants. I wear a belt with everything I do, and I try to promote myself as a businessman. So when you see me, you know I'm about business. Don't let the tattoos and, and, and the gold teeth uh, and my color fool you. You feel me? Because I come get you. Big bank, take a little bank. I don't play no games around here with you at all. Take you all the way to the river. But, you know, it's just crazy. Like, I think me and my wife was the only one in that dollar store without no mask. This is why I made this video for y'all, Fargo family. Get in the comments and let me know. If y'all tell me and the wife, let me put it in the camera, there she is. If y'all tell me and the wife to start wearing masks, you know what? Every video I drop, Dirty 30, wherever we doing, back in video, we're going to be strapped up shawty. Bandana or mask. I know y'all like the little content I'm doing because y'all comment and I comment back with y'all. Y'all subscribe. I think I got like 200 subscribers right now. Ain't nothing too big. But the situation is this. If y'all need and think that it's unsafe, and I'm talking to the Fargo family. If y'all not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to it. Then you can become the Fargo family. But y'all that's been rocking with us since my YouTube channel been up for five months. If y'all think me and the wife are being unsafe and taking this stuff non to the literal and just being like out of our comfort zone you know put in the comments mask emoji whatever emoji you want to do but comment mask emoji you, you feel me because i feel like one thing i told my wife how i used to do females before i met her you know when i was out here playing uh been a little player i thought so-called would be uh doing this and doing this you can tell a lot about a woman how she treat her car 
See what I'm saying? If a car dirty, that mm, probably dirty. Don't go downstairs. You might not come up. Deathbed. See what I'm saying? Stinky alert. Stinky alert. You know. But I'm just saying, you can tell a lot about a person about their fingernails. You can tell a lot about a person about just how they present themselves if they are a clean person. You know, Fargo family, I don't know too much about me, but I got OCD about everything. Why I catch hell? Catch hell. Because I got OCD about where is this at? Well, if it was right here, it should have been here. Why are you moving here? You know, I'm always looking for it here. She catch hell. You know, she catch hell. You know, it's like, don't double work. Don't go do something that you know you have to do that you was already finna do. We sanitize our hands going in and out of shippers and receivers anyway. But I'm supposed to put on a mask now. My wife supposed to stop smoking cigarettes. That's gonna kill her. We supposed to stop driving trucks. That's gonna kill us. I'm supposed to stop vaping. That's gonna kill us. We don't drink alcohol unless we at the top of the mook somewhere in the, in the big motel and that's some barefoot or some Muslim do say. We don't do drugs. So, what are we doing wrong? I'm blessed up from the neck up. You feel me? You know, if I'm ready to go, I'm ready to go. That's all I can see. But I thought I had to bring that in you because I think that's a clutch, especially like the uh, the most we've seen, huh? Like everybody in the store had a mask on. Everybody in the store had a mask on. I don't know if it's just them being scared or. Did this city mandate it? Yeah, you know, I mean, you out can go- in public, wear a mask. Right, out in public, but we would have seen the mandate. You know, we work for the biggest company, Swift Transportation, and if there was a mask law involved with us, they would have let us know, like Laredo. Laredo, before we went to Laredo, Fargo family, why you think my wife, four, five states away, started looking for masks, hitting every truck stop, hitting every mom and pop, and then you finally found them over there on the 35. Had to have them to go into Laredo. Swift Transportation, our home terminal is Lancaster, Texas, right here in Dallas, where we at. But he talking about it's bad here. Man, this Swift Transportation drivers on the yard, laughing and talking, uh, like this stuff ain't even going on. And I'm pretty sure it's a lot of terminals like that. They just tell us, you know, keep our six foot on the distance, don't, don't go inside unless we need to go inside. You know, but if you sanitize, you clean, you already clean, you know, hey, it is what it is, you know. But if you stick your hand in your thing and it smells like wing wang, ugh, you may need a mask before the COVID-19. You do this here, you may need a mask for the COVID-19 anyway. You feel me? So it just, it just like, man, is, is it, uh, what's that, uh, the stars virus, that, uh, uh, swine flu, everybody went and got water at 2K2, you know, the millennium, uh, all types of stuff, man, you know, I'm not really, a, a, a I wouldn't even say a socialite, that's not even the type of word, but a politician on the politicking thing, you know, uh, I ain't never felt no recession, don't know nothing about no recession, you know, because my money always been accounted for, and new money on old money, where it need to go. You know, uh, if that was a, a case, then, you know, hey, at the end of the day, man, we should have been wearing masks a long time ago. One more thing before I get out of here, Fargo family. My homeboy hit me up just on some play pretty shit. Talking about what's good, Fargo? Shh, can't call it, man. Got to put a long way for the Fargo, then the y'all. Y'all, you know what I mean? Talking about, man, don't you know that these farmers been giving these cows COVID-19 shots and coronavirus shots for the longest? I said, what you talking about? He said, man, that stuff been out, man. I said, what you mean? And see, he's on the farming side of it. I said, I heard it affect animals. I said, but I ain't heard it affect no cows, no meat, no chicken, no poultry. Huh. I said, they been giving. Now, get in the comments with this, too. I ain't saying I know everything, but he's saying they been giving these cows these COVID-19 shots forever in a day coming across the border and going both ways in a day you feel me so i ain't gonna hold y'all too long man we're almost nine minutes about to get in here and rant on that one man you know because it's like if we have to wear a mask and the city shut down and got a curfew they need to stop all movements but they ain't said nothing about this trucking thing they ain't saying all truckers be or worse they masked up where else is the mask in 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 in, in there for it like that just a righto? Uh, there's a couple other places. Not that I recall right now. Yeah, so we're about five or six places that are de demanding masks. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, but Dallas, Texas, man, man, man. I'm gonna get out of here, man. I just had to rant, get that out of my chest. You know what I'm saying? Just think what y'all think about it. Let me know in the comments, dude. Me and the wife need to start wearing masks. Are we taking this stuff lightly? Is it more than meets the eye? Is it more proof in the pudding? This A come before B? Is it X, Y, and Z? Oh, we just out here living our best life and ready to do anything that it does that we have to do to go because we're in the most dangerous job that we're in. So it's kind of like we don't care, but we do care. But at the end of the day, we still care. So let us know, man. Are people taking it too far being masked up when the city or state that they live in does not require masks? If you caught my Laredo video, I think that video almost got a thousand views off the last time I seen it. Maybe not maybe not a thousand views. I don't know. It's however many views it is. People didn't know that. Thousand dollar fine. They start finding people. But yeah, I'm gonna get out of here, man. It's your boy Long Way Fargo. Like, comment, and subscribe. If you're new to the channel, like I said, go ahead and Mike Tyson that bell. Help the algorithm. Hit the like button. You feel what I'm saying? It's your boy Long Way Fargo. How we do it, baby? Keep the steak on our plate. Running up 48. Y'all.